What is this brown box, you might ask? Well, I got the Make It Mini. I guess all these things need. <laughs> the Mega Pack. I saw another provider. Not a provider. Another creator. Open it. And I have to say, I... MGA's Miniverse Make It Mini. Let me see it. Got it from Amazon. Oops. Oh, goodness. There was a little bit off. It's really cute plate, so you can use that for a background if you want. It's got like a little menu with ingredients and instructions, a meal planner, shopping list. I'm not really sure what the tabs on the side are for. This is I'm not sure. We'll figure it out. Okay, so here are the same instructions. So. Use the crispers and crates to store it. Use the divider on the left side to ensure your contents remains the spaces on the top. Oh, so this is a divider for you to stick in there. Okay, so that way stuff doesn't fall out everywhere. And you can customize it and store it. And I guess if you want to hang it on the wall, there's place for screws to go. Oh, you can put it on the wall for display. Talks about doing resin. Has it in Spanish. And always. Okay, so that's what that is. So this is if you want to make a cute little pop-up display. It is pretty massive. And it's got some cute little one set here. I have to say that I am. Oh, nice, how cute. But it's one storage case with eight drawers, so four of them are crates and four are clear. And a bunch of little doodaddies. Let's see here. Let's just push that down. Oh my goodness. That is not open as I thought it would be. Okay. <laughs> Come on, darling. We can do it. got a bunch of cute storage things as far as how it's set up right now. You can smell the resin. The resin's really pretty stinky. 
So let's see here. So what we have got. So let's just start. I just want to look at it, how it's all laid out. So it's got two bowls. Cake stand that's light pink. Here's a nice little. Oops. I think these are the extra shelves. Yeah, extra shelves. It's got two drink cups. Strawberries, kiwis, straws, and some tongs. Looks like there's some paper placemats, bananas, blue raspberry. Got a crate, a box for your donuts, donuts and cinnamon rolls. Oh, I guess it's uh, well probably these are for the donuts and then these are for the cinnamon rolls. That one is. We have apple juice or orange juice, but orange orange slices. We've got macaroni with soup. So I guess we'll have just what... That seems like kind of a weird thing to have in there. They have rainbow colored pancakes on their pretty box. Choco nana rings. Maple syrup for that presumably. The Les Sweet Sun Baked Macarons. the sorbet and their little sorbet pieces. So here we have cola and chips. Oh, why don't we don't have cheese sauce? I mean there's oat milk or the those. I guess we'll have to use cheese sauce from something else but super spicy tortilla chips. Okay, so avocado, blueberry, Great. Serving platter, serving platter. Light pink bowls. Knives, spoons, forks, two kinds of ice. Cake, a dessert. Tiered white chocolate glaze. Little mini tarts. White chips, yellow sprinkles, and looks like pink and blue sprinkles. Grape jelly and bread. Interestingly, no peanut butter. So, you kind of just tasting. It's like really well stuck in there. Oh, it's too good. And then, ooh, little cardboard pieces are not attached. I suppose if you wanted to do like double sided tape or something that would probably be the way to go here. You could have your little... Is that how they go? Oh, they go like this. Okay. okay. Oops. <laughs> right. How did you go? There's a little thing on the top, right? Yeah. There's a little thing on the bottom. And then... Okay, you push it in. Alright. If you want to keep all of the little great and cardboardy pieces where they go. Oops. Put all the extra slices. Extra ones of these in. Wait, are they all just in there? Yeah, oh that's cool because you can actually move all the shelves. And these don't oops, don't need a shell. So just the little suggested recipes. Do they not fit in the shelves? Oh they don't. They only fit. Hmm. Okay, so the the shelves and the little storage thingy bobs don't combine well, but the because the shelves. 
shells are just a little bit too thick. Interesting. Okay. and textured. And the box I can keep going. Oh my goodness. So I'm going to ruin it here a little bit. Empty and cute. Okay, see the orange one is supposed to be smiling. Pink one's got some cream. Okay, and I don't know where did I throw the other one. Okay, let's put the straws in there for now. Okay, and your donuts. I hate your donuts. Here's a box for donuts. I'll put the donuts in there. Okay, donuts. Cinnamon swirl. Cinnamon swirl. Um, yeah, I'd say it's kind of a hard plastic. You might want one in there. I mean, I know you can use it for display, but I want to put them in the box now. I can put them in there all tidy. There's two cinnamon rolls. cute stuff in the clear ones. So like the fruit. So here's your kiwi. It's a little more better centered than others. Yeah. Not like a huge fan of the kiwis. And here are the some black raspberries. Okay. And then there's a bananas. And you know, the bowls are kind of chunky, aren't they? See, I love this though. This is super cute. I like the little pink cake platter. I actually have some pink depression glass platters like this, which it's kind of harder to tell that it is in fact pink, but when you compare it against the white, you can tell definitely it's pink. Alright, now here's one of my test is. Mm, it will stack okay. <laughs> like if I had this on my shelves. Alright. Um, the rest of this great. I'm gonna go orange places. There's I think four. I think that's one downside of this one is that they really just didn't give you very much. Here's another pinky. That's all three pinkies. All three rainbow pinkies. little cardboard cut out for it to drink because it's supposed to be a, like a little orange juice splash. Of course, 
Spoosh. Here's our oat milk. I'm 100% happy. And then here's our pasta. It's very squishy. I like it. Somebody else. The person I watched who did it. Man, these guys are really close. Showed that. Yeah, they have the little extension in there. So it's less pasta than it looks like. Which, I mean, for a do whatever you want kind of thing. Makes it hard. So this one shows it's like a macaroni and cheese, right? But we didn't get any cheese sauce. Which, I mean, why would we not get cheese sauce? I mean, that doesn't make sense, right? We got our little tomato soup. This is definitely resin. I think the can is super cute, though. That's one of the things I really think is a strength about these, is the containers of the resin are just so cute. A weakness is that they've been giving us less resin. Which, I mean... How can we do the projects without the resin? This is rude. I think you really don't want to sit in there, do you? Hmm. That's how. Oops. <laughs> okay, maybe I can kind of do it like that. Now, that's the downside of these kind of cute jars. I think it's just so they don't really fit in there. Hmm. I guess I can put it upside down a little bit. That's fine. Okay, so far as it fits everything. Right, and now uh, we're gonna do this side. See over here the resin really stinks. I don't know which one it is. These are kind of like a, a little bit hard erasery. Just have such a like a really good texture. They have the just feels good. And we get a little mango sorbet. Got a little non-nutritional facts over here. I don't know if you can read them. Super tiny. Yeah. Gives you two slices of bread. Which is weird because, like, why would you put grape jam on rye bread? This is really cute. It's probably good for the macarons or the tarts. And it is all recyclable. I like that. 
Not all the time do they give you, like, when you have horrendous amounts of packaging like this, do they give you recyclable ones. It's always kind of a pain. So, and these are different, you know, things. Um, they don't all match, and they don't all have things that's actually with them. Because this is, shows the... Um, looks like grape and jelly. So there's that tier. Okay, so... Now, because the crates have those little openings, I'm just going to put all the little forky bits in there. Jars, they say mini. Actually, we like the jars. They've got a really good shot size, and they've got a little bit of a lid, so they actually do screw on and off without too much trouble. Which I mean, it's good. They do. Let's see here. I have to say, I personally am not a fan of mass and dryers. Not for any fault of their own, but I think it's too many of those things to swear out. Okay. Get some more resin. Now, when I got this, I got it kind of knowing it essentially gives you four projects, four or five projects in the case. And that's how I used my price comparison. Is my thought was, well, this gives you the price, the value of the number of projects. So fun. So cute. So cute. But it also um, gives you the case. And I have a lot of kind of bitty foods that I need to charge for. So. Oh, see, that's like chocolate chips. And they are, oh, look, they actually even have a little, like, swirly bit on the chocolate chips. I haven't done any projects that need chocolate chips, so that's really cute. I like it. I saw. Put you. Oh, what are these? <gasps> Strawberries. Blueberries. Oh, here's my donut mug. I threw it on the floor. Or the bottom here. Okay. Oh. Yeah, let me see. I do have little whipped creams, right? Oh, they're so tiny. So tiny. Just three little ones. I mean, they're super cute, but... So tiny. Part of why they're cute. Hmm. Maybe I'll stick those back here. Ah. Shelf, 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 shelf. <laughs> Just like. Okay. That's like kind of my. The big good ones. I'm gonna shove it on the side there. I like how I'm like, here guys, here is me just pushing everything together. I'm just kind of hoping it fits in there. But, okay. Let's, sorry. Take this. Down here. 
there's another one on the shelf. And use all this crumble. And I have my little apples from the Halloween one. And still kept the resin. So this caramel could kind of look like peanut butter almost if you're going to do like peanut butter and jelly. And I wonder if part of what they mean, like their plot was, was that, um, that people would keep these things for the projects and put them together like this. Um, just like I am here. Uh, let's see, here, can I put you in there? Yeah. There you go. Now, the only thing I think is kind of a downside is there's not really any place to put, like, your table. I mean, not that, like, I would say they need that for sure. But you can't even really, I mean, I guess I could do that. Fits in there that way. I can keep my little table. Okay, well, let's just try it like this and see. <laughs> Got all my flopping together. I'm like, okay. Got, oh, I didn't show you the outside of this. So it's got a hole on either side so you can use it for uh, mounting on the wall if you want. And it's kind of cute. This here's our fridge, our kitchen counter, the spatulas and whisks and bowls and things. And that kind of um, pop art sort of way. And then they've got the knives and other things list. Uh, I mean, the make job of this isn't great because, like, the paint's a little bit wonky here. And I don't know what that is other than it's like a defect. It's a little bit of a defect here. So, I feel like this product they could have done a little bit more with as far as the actual project itself. The handle. I mean, it's okay. But, I mean, it could be better. We'll see how it has how it holds up. I'll put like some more videos because I did buy more of this little set. I have to say that I am. I've always really liked tiny food. Yep. Yeah. Okay, so let's try this. Oh, those extra shells came right out too. Um. <laughs> yeah, if you want it to stick in there, you definitely need like tape or like, lobster putty or something. Otherwise, it will just go laps out for you here. But I mean, like literally just being like, oh, here, let me include a piece of cardboard for you to keep stuff from falling out. That doesn't really stay in there. I'll try it and see if it'll stay on the right side any better. And then maybe. 
left side was the one they suggested, and it just falls right out. But I don't have any shelves over there. So, um, I mean, that's what I would come down to on this, is that if you have a bunny need to have a themed storage unit, and you have impulse control problems, this might be a good investment. Um, I certainly wouldn't pay more than 60 for it because the projects that it includes. Goodness, I did not want to open. Open, Sesame. Open! Just hold that open. This is recycling too. Uh, most places don't have four for a pickup though. So most of the things you can make, let's see here, you can make with the included items. Let's see here, one, two, three, four, five recipes. Interestingly, this involves you having cut the macarons. Because those are full circles of what they provide you. This gives you some cereal. So, I mean, you can do more than five because you definitely have more than just the drink. So, bonus recipes that gives you. So, like, hey, if you want to cut them in half, that's cool. If you want to use the white chocolate to make them, then you could do that too. But yeah, and so they haven't been given a whole lot of resin, so. But I am a sucker for themed stuff. And so we got it. Separator in there for now. I think these are supposed to be what, like little tables. So I'll just say what they're. Um, so three. Well, it's a French one. Oh, it's a French. Okay, so there are the tabs upright. So one, carefully push along proliferation to take out all the pieces. Oh, these are the smaller side pieces is what that is. So you use the side pieces to attach to the big piece to make it sturdier to support all your stuff. But yeah, I mean, I don't, like, for the, like, the level of quality they could have done, like, literally giving you a piece of cardboard <laughs> so stuff doesn't fall out everywhere when you take it as a travel case, that's, that's a bit much. And as far as, like, display cases go, it's, it's cute, but it's not, it definitely could be better. If you're a completionist, if you're a sucker for themed carry cases, if you have just oh that defect again, um, you like the pop art color and design, then you know, go for it. Do what you like. But just figured I would show my unboxing. <laughs> of our friend. I think cardboard works pretty well. I guess I'll just have to keep using that. But I'm super excited that I can put stuff in here. Alright, thank you for watching and you have a good night.